Hey, Jody, got a what? joke for you. What? <laughs> hey, Jody, I got a good joke for you. What's that? You know what's big, round, and yellow all over? No, what? A dome home. Really? Is this cool looking or what? Now I know it looks kind of small on the outside, but let's go inside and check out how big it actually looks. Now see, we've taken up all the carpet and stained the floors. Now check this out. Let's pan up, see how high the ceilings are with the open space and a little sun roof in the top. Now it's basically divided into half with the living space in the front half, which would include your living room, dining room, and kitchen. Now there you can see the pantry and a closet as well as the kitchen and the dining room area. There's your front door. Now notice how thick these walls are. This building is really green and good for utility bills. Now the kitchen's small but it's really laid out effectively. It has a good working triangle. See there's your sink, stove and refrigerator. If we pan up again you're going to get a nice view of how high the ceilings are and what a good open space it is. Now let's go in this back half and check out the bedrooms and the bath. Notice again, there's the stained concrete floors throughout the whole place. Okay, that's bedroom number one. Let's go out in the hall and check out the second bedroom, which is basically a mirror image of that one, just the closets on the other side. Now the bedrooms are a bit challenging since they are in pie shapes. Now notice in the bathroom, it's a pretty good sized bathroom. And also in the back we have an area for a full-size washer and dryer. And of course you have the standard tub and shower along with a good place for storage. So there's one more bedroom so let's go out in the hall and check it out. Now this bedroom is bigger than the other two and it also has a pretty good sized closet. And not to mention this red accent wall. Okay well that does it for the inside. Let's go out and check out the yard. We can cut through the kitchen. Notice there's a small little patio area here and a ginormous backyard. So and it's also fenced in. There you can see the patio again. So if you're into a green living environment in a cool place that's pet friendly, Spike says call Eddie now. <laughs>